Good morning, guys. This is Rose from a Catholic homeschooling family, and it is June seventh. I can never remember the date. About eight forty a.m. It's a Friday, and I am actually at my like thyroid doctor's office. I don't know how to say it. He's not an endocrinologist. He's just like he's not a homeopathist. If that's the right word, I don't know. Mm. Like it does like natural stuff, right? Um, as much as possible. Um, but my thyroid is being treated with actual medicine. But he's very, very talented and very, very smart. At least here in Laredo. I have a big itch right here and I can't seem to get it. I'm like, oh, scratching, 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 scratching. Um, anyway, so I'm here and it's eight about well, eight forty. He's not even here yet. The nurses just told me and I'm his second patient. And anyways, so I have, so it's pretty cool because I don't have to bring my kids. I, I don't think I've ever not, I don't know, maybe I have, but I feel so like at peace maybe. I don't know. I feel good because I don't have to bring my kids. It's, it's a big hassle and they scream like they're, they're not like fighting. They're just like playing so loudly and I don't have to bring them today. Yay. So, so, so cool. Um, so I have free time right now while I wait. So I decided to make this video. I have the worst. Oh, guys, look, I'm going bald right here. Can't even believe it. Like, I noticed that last night. Like, babe. To my husband, yelling in panic. I'm losing my hair. Oh, I hear the doctor. I hear him in the hallway. But I'm not, not even his first patient. So if he comes in, I'm going to cut it off right away. Um, what was I going to say? So, I have that doctor's appointment, and then after this, I have, this appointment was at 8.30, and then at 10 o'clock, I have, and it's not even far from here, it's like, far, like five blocks away from here, I have another doctor's appointment, because I'm considered like high risk because of my age, a high risk pregnancy because of my age, I have another doctor's appointment with a Driscoll Maternal Fetal Medicine, I'm not really sure what that is, but they like specialize in pregnancies or something. So they're gonna do like something like, oh, he's in with the patient because I just heard him say something like in that room right there, <laughs> like the next room. I heard him say something about, I heard him say thyroid. So he'll probably come in like in the next like three, four minutes. He's really, really fast. So, I have an appointment at 10 o'clock with this, like, pregnancy specialist people. And then I have to go to the grocery store. But my, my children, my three older children love going to the grocery store. That man likes to go too, but he doesn't, like, love it. Um, and I'd, I'd, I'd rather take less kids than more kids. So, after my 10 o'clock appointment, I have to go, um... Depending on how tired I am. I love it that my husband is home. Like, But just today, just on Fridays. Um, because on Fridays is the day that I usually run errands. So like, I have like Thursday designated for cleaning and Friday designated for errands. Because my husband gets paid on Friday. Well, every other Friday. But i just gotten used to scheduling things on Friday. And so, um, so he's home because of the situation with his job, right? Anyways, that's pretty, that's like, like the only benefit, right? My hair's horrible. I don't know what's happening with it. And it's like the only benefit for him, like not working like a normal traditional schedule. But I would rather really have him home like weekends and evenings. Somebody's calling me. I keep getting like these scam likely freaking phone calls. It's so nice. Um, but yeah. And then last so yeah, that's what I'm going to do today. And there's no more ballet for the summer. So yeah, doctor, doctor, grocery store. So I have to go pick up my kids to go to the grocery store because they really like to go. Also, my husband is home. I can leave the 12-year-old. And I am actually going to leave the baby because he's the worst one of all. He keeps trying to crawl out of the... You know how the babies sit in the front? In like the little like chair that faces mom? He keeps trying to crawl out of that. So I hate taking him to the grocery store. But anyways, I will have to come back in a little bit with my when I have my children because something sad happened yesterday night, yesterday evening. And I will let them 
tell you because they like to they like to talk about stuff dramatic stuff all right guys i'll be back in a little bit hi guys it is now about 11 45 p.m and me and my daughter mia bella are at mcdonald's having our brunch um i had breakfast but she didn't have anything to eat so after the doctor after my second doctor's appointment i went to the house to pick her up and her daddy was like you and me i should have a mother-daughter morning and so she went to h-e-b with me and then my here my starbucks lover show you are a Starbucks lover. Show them your drink. What is it? A double chocolate chip? I think it is. A double chocolate chip frappuccino. Without coffee. Yeah, with no coffee. And then I brought her to McDonald's so she could have a cheese, double cheeseburger. Is it french fries? We're still waiting for them to bring us a... Uh, here, hold it. Ketchup. Salt and ketchup. I asked them to bring me salt and ketchup and they haven't brought it. I don't know why they're taking so long. And so she got this at Starbucks for like four something. No, four dollars. Like four dollars. Like I think it was like four fifty. No, was. And then mine was. I got one too. Two dollars. For two dollars. Both the same. Just about the same thing. Just, just about the same thing. This. But half the price or double the price, however you want to see it. Yours is like. But it's still pretty good. Yeah, actually, I do. Think is that, that caramel? I. It is caramel. I actually think that this this one is just a, the Mirabella's is just a little, little bit better. But it's just about the same thing. I like caramel. Okay, Mama. Do you want to say what happened yesterday with the mouses? They died. That's all you're going to say? Yeah. You don't want to talk about it? No. Nope. Oh, I thought you did. Okay. Why would I want to talk about my dead mouses? Because <laughs> you wanted to talk about it yesterday. No. Okay. All right. All right, guys. So, let me hear. Hold it in there right now when I say to stop it myself. Let me go figure out what happened to my salt and my ketchup. My and, ketchup. Well, Ke me as ketchup because I don't, I don't like, I like to dip my fries in salt. It's the worst. But let me go figure out what happened to the salt and the ketchup situation so we can have our brunch, guys. We'll be back in a little bit. Bye. Stop recording? Yes. Bye. No, say hi. Hi. Hi, Bye. guys. Okay, it's about, hi. it is about, about 5.15 or so already. And we actually ended up staying at McDonald's for a little bit. Uh, around, uh, so I guess I showed up somewhere around 11.30, 11.45 more or less. And then I, uh, I was, my, my daughter was having such a good time playing, so we didn't want to leave. I called my husband. I told Mommy, him I was going to be there for a little while. I'm, on, I'm making a video. That's cute. Um, I ended up staying there for a little while because my daughter was having fun. She didn't want to leave. So I called. I'm sorry, guys. It's so hot. Like, it's 110 no, degrees or something outside right now. Ser like, for real. I'm not being sarcastic or, I mean, dramatic. It's actually like 110 degrees. Literally. Um, so we ended up staying there for a little while. Call my husband around maybe like I don't remember, I don't really remember maybe around 1:30 to tell him that I was gonna stay there for another little while longer. So he came. He showed up with the, my boys. We stayed there for another little while longer. We left somewhere around four o'clock. I had all the groceries in the car. So when I got home, right? Well, I guess I got home around four, and it's only like five minutes away. Uh, all the groceries were all sweaty and I was worried about the lettuce because it's like lettuce in a bag. It's not actually like the head of lettuce. And it was all like, I thought it was going to be all smoky. And I bought like a DiGiorno's pizza. I actually bought two DiGiorno's pizza because they had a special, like a coupon where if you buy the two DiGiorno's, they would give you like a uh, Toll House cookie dough and a soda and some, the, the, le the salad. And a couple of, I can't remember. Oh, yeah, and like two boxes of Hot Pockets. That was like a really good deal um, for, for junk food. So I was like, that instead of going out to eat on Sunday, we'll have that with a movie. And so 
went to McDonald's, right? Stayed there really late. Got home. Not didn't stay there really late. Just stayed there for a long time. Is what I mean. So got home and unloaded all the groceries from the van. My kids did help me unload the groceries though. And then I just finished putting everything away. That's what I hate about going to the grocery store. I hate going. I hate shopping. I hate coming, like getting it out of the car, and I hate putting it away. <sighs> but I, uh, you know, we only do that every other Friday. Now I do go to the grocery store throughout the week, but it's usually just like for milk or bread or something like that. And so it is now 5:15, and my baby is taking a nap. He fell asleep in the car from our way from. A, he fell asleep in the car when we were driving back home from McDonald's, and so he's doing that right now. I wanted to catch up with you real quick, and then right now I'm gonna pay the bills. That's what that's what I do on Friday. Friday it's usually kind of like this today, right? Um, I usually don't go to McDonald's, but I think I might start going to McDonald's on Friday. Maybe. So I'm, I'm thinking about it. But I am going to go, if I can, make time to do this. I'm going to go have fr the free lunch at the library. I'm going to eat at the, well, I'm going to take my kids to eat at the library for free. And then I'm going to go to McDonald's and buy a soda and maybe like a couple of ice creams. Just to like, not show up and not spend money there. I think that's what I'm going to do. Um, so yeah, and right now, like I said, I'm going to pay bills and I don't think we have actually any plans at all for this weekend. I really, 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 really don't think we have anything. Like right now I'm thinking, do I have any plans? I know I don't have any plans. I don't know. My husband mentioned some plans to me, but I don't think he didn't. He's not here right now. He went out real quick. Um, but yeah, that's going to be it for the rest of the day. Oh, he woke up! Bugga bunny! <laughs> it's a bunny? A toy. A toy? Yes. Good morning! Oh! <laughs> oh no, guys! So that's gonna be it. Let me get, get that baby. I'd like to thank you for calling. Oh, I'd like to thank you for watching a Catholic home. Oh, he's looking for daddy or something. I guess he's okay. Alright, well, anyways. That's going to be it. I don't think there's anything planned for tonight. Um, if there is, I'll catch you guys up tomorrow. Thank you for watching the Catholic Homeschooling Family. God bless you. Bye-bye.